It is your boy Chatty Fam, and we're back again in another car dealership tycoon video. I hope you guys did enjoy the intro, but today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Um, I couldn't think of a video idea, so I thought this would have been a or this will be a very good idea. So, um, I'm going to tell you what we, what we will be doing in today's video in just a little bit. But before we get into it, guys, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you'll be notified whenever your boy does upload a video. And without further ado, let's get straight into it. So, what we're going to be doing, guys, we're going to be driving around the city and we're going to be rating people's dealerships from 1 to 10. Yes, guys, that's what we're going to be doing in today's video. I didn't have anything else to um, make a video on. I could have did it on the new event. Um, I almost have almost have 500 so i can get the the first car that costs 500 trophies but yeah guys we're gonna be making a video on that a little bit later but yeah guys that's what we're gonna be doing in today's video checking out people's dealerships and rating them from 1 to 10 1 being the absolute worst and 10 being the absolute best so without further ado let's get straight into it guys all right so obviously we're gonna start out my dealership obviously i'm gonna give it a whole 10 because, like, this is a limited cars only dealership. These are, like, some of the most expensive. Well, not most expensive. See, guys, it's doing it again. My, my Bugatti's just driving away. You know, it, it, it happens. I don't know. I think Foxy needs to fix that car. There's something wrong with it. But, guys, um, this is the McLaren P1 GTR right here. This was a limited car back in, well, near Christmas. The Christmas update. This car actually came out. And... I think this car will eventually resell because it will get a OG wrap. And then we got the Bugatti Pure Sport. Personally, one of my favorite Bugattis in the game. Um, because I've always wanted this car to be in the game. And it's only $9.5 It's not even that expensive, to be honest. But I'm pretty sure this car is going to resell. And it's going to be twice the price as this. Like, it's going to be at least... 15 million dollars just to get it once it resell and then we got the Fenry Super Sport I don't know if this car is ever going to resell. I honestly couldn't see a wrap on this car But you know, I guess it would be cool and then we got all the 6 by 6s back here We got the Jeep 6 by 6 then we got the G wagon 6 by 6 and then we got the Hennessy Veloport 6 by 6 with the OG limited wrap guys that actually looks insane so um, um We still have upstairs to check out I'm obviously going to give myself a 10, because once again, guys, it's my old dealership. I'm not going to rate my own self down. Then we got, personally, one of my favorite Lamborghinis in the game, because this is extremely fast. It's $18 million, guys. This car was originally only originally $12 million, and now it's $18 million since it resettled. And I was like, I had to buy it. Because I couldn't get it when it first came out near the Halloween updates. And then we got the $20 million Bugatti Vision GTR. This is my most expensive car that I have right now. And let me tell you guys, this is probably going to end up being one of my favorite cars inside the game. Just look at the interior, guys. That just looks insane. And then we got the La... F I mean, not the La Ferrari. The Ferrari FFK Evo. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. F... FFK Evo, yeah, I'm just gonna call it the Ferrari Evo. Honestly, probably one of the best looking cars in the game. Like, this just looks absolutely insane. Um, this is the best Ferrari in the game, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah, obviously, I'm gonna give myself a 10 out of 10 because, bro, where's my car? Like, where's my car? It's gone. But obviously, I'm gonna give myself a 10 out of 10 because it's my own dealership. But let's check out more people's dealerships. Let's see. What other dealerships we're going to check out. Even if they're not fully completed, we're still going to check them out. Okay, we got this dealership over here. You know what? I'm not going to rate this because of respect. You know, I'm just going to drive past this. Okay, guys? All right, so we got another dealership over here. This one looks actually completely built. So let's check it out. Let's check it out, you guys. I'm already seeing some really cool cars. Let's check it out. All right, so this guy's dealership is called Nothing. Okay, he doesn't have a title. Um, ooh, okay, he already has a, I'm pretty sure this car costs a robot. It's only $8 million for this? But well, I thought this car was way more expensive. This is the Konensek Jesco. Uh, this is a really cool car. And then we got the Ferrari La Ferrari. The La Ferrari Ferrari made by Ferrari. That's literally what it's called. And it's only $2.7 million. $2,750,000 to be exact. And then we got the Tesro Millennial. This is definitely going to get um make the dealership a high rating because this is personally one of my favorite cars in the game. 
And then we got some cars over here. Ooh, okay, this guy's dealership is not too bad. Um, we got the Conan Seg, he, another Conan Seg. I actually don't know the name of this. So, guys, hopefully you guys can help me in the comments and tell me what this car is called. I know it's a Conan Seg, but I just forgot the name. And then we got the Bugatti. Yes, he has it, bro. This is also going to make the dealership get a high rating. This thing costs $20 million. Another car that costs Robux, Um, the Conan Seg S. Does this cost Robux, you guys? I think it does. Hold up. Let me check. Let me check. Uh, shoot. Yeah, I think that's... The, no. I don't think so. I think this is the, the limited one. I'm not too sure, guys. Um, I think, yeah, I think that's the limited one. Because the one that costs Robux has, like, a stripe in the middle of it. Yeah, right there. So, yeah, I think that's the limited one. Oh, let's go upstairs. Let's see what she has upstairs, you guys. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's start out with this. Is this the McLaren Senna GTR? Oh, no, this is just the regular one. I thought this was a GTR. No, this is just the McLaren. Wait, is this? Yeah, no, this is just the regular one. This is the $1,250,000 one. And then we have the Bugatti Chiron right here, which is um $5 million. Honestly, not a bad car. This is probably, like, one of the best starter hyper cars in the game. And then the new... Uh, Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. Guys, I really want this car. Like, just look at it, bro. I like, honestly, I just like the back. The back looks absolutely insane with the, with the, um, with these holes in the back. That looks so cool, you guys. In my opinion, I can't wait to get this car, bro. This is going to be sick. I'm already at $6 million. I need, like, $4 million, I think. Well, $4 million. A little bit less than $4 million. All right, guys, let's go to the next dealership. Oh, and the rating, I'll give it an 8 out of 10. Um, it, it's pretty good. I just, honestly, I don't like the color, the green and the white. I, I'm not feeling that, but I'll give it an 8 out of 10, you guys. Um, let's go to the next the dealership. Okay, we got a police dealership here right next to the other one that didn't have a name, so I don't know what to call it. So what is this dealership called? Also nothing. Okay, um, we're just gonna call it the police dealership since that's what it is, but it doesn't have a title, so we're just gonna call it the police dealership. Alright, so let's enter this dealership. Ooh, ooh, okay, I'm already seeing some McLarens over here. No, let's go, let's go this way and make our way over there, and then we're gonna go upstairs. Or should we go this way, make our way over here, and then go up? You know, let's go this way. So we got, I'm pretty sure one of these are the free McLaren, but I'm not too sure. This is the McLaren Racer. Honestly, I don't know what this is called, but this is a really cool McLaren. It's only two hundred, um, two hundred and twenty-five thousand dollars you guys. You know, this is not bad. This is... Um, honestly, used to be one of my favorite cars in the game when I was first starting, but now since there's like so many other limited vehicles out there now, yeah, this is the free one right here. I don't think I can give this a rating since it is free, guys, but yeah, it, it's really cool, and I think I do have it. I'm not too sure. And then uh, this, I see a Lamborghini Conta, Cont Countach, uh, Corroach, sorry, not the Countach, Countach is something else. This is the Lamborghini Corroach, and, uh, it's an old-fashioned, you know, nothing... I mean, you can't hate on it, guys. It is old-fashioned, you know, social respect, $248,000, you guys. And then we have the, I'm pretty sure this is a Corvette, and it's only $240,000. So this is actually a really decent dealership, not gonna lie. Uh, definitely the last one was a lot better, you guys, but, you know, this one's pretty cool. Oh, and then we got uh the Bentley. Ooh, the Bentley. Bentley, I think. Whatever, guys. It's only 148000 but I, I'm digging the gold wheels, though. That looks nice. I'm actually digging the gold wheels. And then we got, I think this is the free group car. I think, yeah, I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is the group car. Um, Let me check. I could be wrong, yeah. I think I think it's not the group car. I could be wrong. I could be totally wrong. Jab Ranger. Yeah, no, this is not the group car. This is only $42,000. $42, wow. I didn't know they was that cheap, to be honest. And then we got the Bontley Central, which is $190,000. And then we got the Aeron Nomad, which is only $92,000. Um, $92, so, um, I will rate this dealership 5 out of 10. Because there's not really that many supercars. N n there's not a single hypercar, but there's not that many supercars inside this dealership. And that's what we're looking for, you guys. We're looking for fancy supercars. Um, Let's drive this. Let's drive the Tesro. All right, next dealership, guys. Mm, okay, we're going out of the city. Let's go this way. Ooh, we got another dealership here. I see a blue one. I'm pretty sure we didn't check this out already. So, yeah, let's go over here. I see a blue one. Well, I think we did. No, we didn't because the last one was green. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Ooh, okay. This dealership already looking smazzy, bro. Okay, so we oh we got the fastest car in the game. 
only twelve point five million dollars. That's crazy. That's actually not that expensive. For this to be like the fastest car in the game, you would expect this to be like twenty million dollars at least. This is literally the fastest car in the game. Well, yeah, fastest car in the game. It goes up to like three eleven, I think. This is like twelve point five. So yeah, this is Koenigsegg absolute fastest car in the game. Cost Robux. Then we got the other Robux car. Not dealing. The, I'm not digging the red wheels. Like I, I don't like that. Um, ten million dollars, not too bad. And then we got the Bugatti Chindo Dieci. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. I absolutely hate this car. Like I do not like this car. This car is so ugly. It's only $18 million. That's that's cheap, actually. But I just don't like this car, honestly. And then we got the Lamborghini... Uh, uh, let me look. I'm, once I look at the name... The Lamborghini Venus, yeah. So, yeah, this one's like um, $5.5 million. Honestly, not too bad. And then we got the um, McLaren Speedtail, the four-seater hypercar, I believe. And it's only $450,000. And then, oh my gosh, bro. Yes, bro. This is really rare, guys. This car, I think I have this. This car is extremely rare. This is the Lamborghini SFO. This car is like one of the rarest cars in the game. So, yes, this dealership is definitely going to get a high rating because of this one car loan. It's only $450,000. Yeah, this is, that's an extremely rare car, you guys. I'm not even going to lie. Um, Let's go upstairs, guys. I think I actually might grind for the Lamborghini. Ooh, another... Wait, is this... I think this car's in the game. Never mind, my bad. I'm not sure. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, no, it's definitely not in the game. It costs $10 million. Yeah, no, this is like one of the um, limited vehicles. Yeah, for sure. And then we got... Is this not GTR? I think this is not the GTR. Yeah, this is just a regular... One hundred um one million two hundred and fifty thousand one. But yeah, guys, still a McLaren. It's really cool. And then we got the, the Conan Seg Jesco, which is... Only $8 million. I'm still surprised by that, to be honest. This dealership is going to get a 7 out of 10, you guys. But yeah, let's go to the next. We're going to check out one more dealership, you guys. One more. Let's get it. One more. Let's see whose dealership is about to be judged. If you see your dealership in this video, comment down below, you guys. Uh, let's, check out, let's check out this one. This one is red and blue, like Captain America, I guess. Uh, let's check this one out, you know? Wait, what's the name? What's the name? Bro, why does any of these people's dealership have names? <laughs> Bro, what the heck? Okay, so we got the Tesla Cybertruck here. Um, it's only 152, but it's really cool in my opinion. And I don't even know what this car is. This It's a Luxus. It's a Luxus. It's only 16... Wow, this is... This car is cheap as heck. $16,000? That's it? At least 100, bro. It's, once again, oh, he has to find multiply. I could tell this guy's really start, um, just starting the game if he still has this car on this podium. But, you know, I mean, we got beginners, you know. You can't hate him for it. Then we got $22,000 truck. Um, This is really cool. I'm not digging the red, though. I mean, the um, the blue wheels. I'm not digging it at all. I think they should have made the wheels white. Yeah, it would have looked way better. And then we go upstairs. Ooh. Oh, the guy just left. He left the game. All right, guys. I'm going to end the video here, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Hit that post notification bell for your boy. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace and have a great day.